Good morning, everyone. I hope you're well and you're enjoying your holidays. I'm certainly enjoying my virtual, <laughs> virtual beach right now. I just want to say a huge thank you to everybody who contributed to the fund for the Chiswick Community School. Their head there, Laura Eleanor, is doing an incredible job looking after the children who would be on free school meals and the money that you have contributed is um, gone towards 400 lunch uh, bags full of supplies, essential supplies for the children last week and also helping Elizabeth who's also still working at the school with the children there who need, who need uh, to stay in school. They're working on the allotment so they, the money has helped to buy some strawberry plants. I've been really impressed to hear of the kindness of you children at home and the way you're looking after your family. So thank you so much for that. Every single day, I want you to just think of another kind thing that you can do. I was reflecting on this for myself and I managed to get some extra chicken from the farmer's market. So I'm going to be making a, a stew that's big enough for Norman who lives down the road and can't get out at the moment and for my mother-in-law. So I'm gonna make a big stew and take that round, hopefully this evening. I went looking for writing paper uh, to write letters to my relatives and I could only find a Harry Potter writing set. So they'll be getting some Harry Potter letters this week as well. But I want you to be thinking every day, what little act of kindness can you do? Because as we know, as we've been taught at the Lyceum, being kind to other people not only makes them happy, but it makes you happy too. Think of that lovely story of the rainbow fish who, while she had all her own sparkly scales, was lonely. And it was only when started to share those sparkly fish, giving one to everybody else, that suddenly her whole world opened up and she became a happy little fish. <laughs> so I want you to be happy little fishes this week and by making other people happy. I've also had a good idea from Sarah Denton, who is actually going camping this week in her garden. She's going to get her tent out and her whole camping kit. She's going camping in her garden. You may not have a garden. You may not have a tent. So you could make yourself a little den or a special camp indoors using, uh, you can put two chairs together and put a blanket over the top or some sheets and make yourself a den. And then you can have virtual tea parties with your friends over Zoom, or you can take lovely photographs of your dens, your little camps, put books in there, the things that you love to do, some drawing, some artwork, and you can give your parents some quiet time by you going into your den every day. So make your den into something beautiful. You can do artwork, wallpaper for, for your den, and just make that a space where you can go and enjoy and be happy. So I hope you have a lovely week. I'll be sending you another little message on Friday for the weekend. I'd like you to send in photos of your dens and also pictures of you being kind and some um, notes from your parents about how kind you've been. So have a lovely week. Look after yourselves. Keep healthy, keep safe, keep warm and see you on Friday. Bye. Bye bye.